One, two, three. Hi, I'm Dr. Melanie Palm from Artiskin MD in San Diego, California. And today I'm going to be talking about the Resurfix laser, which is the latest in non-ablative technology. It's made by a company called Luminous, which is well known for some of its other laser and light technologies, including IPL and its fractionated CO2 device called the UltraPulse. Um, it's just been out a few months now. If you've ever heard of Fraxel, it's somewhat similar to that. So it's non-ablative, meaning it's minimal downtime. The skin gets a little bit pink for somewhere between one and three days, and then your skin feels a little bit sandpapery for about five to seven days, but something that you can actually put makeup on. I actually had the procedure done about five days ago, so you can see you're in really good shape with very limited downtime. We're gonna be treating this patient. She's got great collagen, but we just wanna ensure that when we do resurfix, it's always done as a series of treatments. So I typically recommend about four. They're spaced about a month apart. It really is something that you can typically do on a Thursday or Friday, and you can easily be back to work on Monday with no problem. It takes about 15 minutes to do the face. Other common areas that we do are the neck and the chest and often the back of the hands as well. And we use topical numbing. That's all that's required. Typically, patients feel very little. We'll kind of monitor that while we go. Um, afterwards, it feels like a little bit of a sunburn sensation for about an hour or so that quickly dissipates. And after that, it's really no discomfort. You might have just a little bit of swelling and like I mentioned, the redness and then eventually the sandpaper you feel. Um, so with that, we're going to get started. So I typically start on the forehead. So I'm going to do a little pulse on three and let me know how that is. One, actually, let me, I'm going to set the re mode so we can just kind of keep on charging along as we go. So with that, we're going to start on three. One, two, three. How was that? Fine. Pretty easy. Uh -huh. Good. Yes. You know, when I had this done about five days ago, I felt very little of it. Um, the forehead cheeks were extremely easy. The most tender area for me was on the cheek just closest to the nose. And even that was not that bad. And so what we'll do is we'll just kind of charge along in this area. This is creating, depending on the density I'm using, tons of little areas of non-ablative injury. And this is gonna cause new collagen growth over a period of um, several weeks to months. Turn to the right for me. And over time, that helps affect acne scarring. It can help with skin texture. It helps build collagen. It helps with fine lines does all the good stuff we want in terms of rejuvenation without some of the downtime of a traditional fractionated CO2 device. And I probably won't end up showing the whole thing, but I want you to get a sense of this, so we'll start treating sort of half of the face. How are you doing so far? Okay? Yes. Good. Fine. Cheeks are pretty easy, aren't they? Mm -hmm. um, things that are nice about this procedure, there's a little chilled tip. We often will do this in combination with cool air. Um, and when we do that, you feel very little of this procedure. And again, if it is tender, we can always adjust things, decrease the density. Um, so it's not difficult for the patient. Aftercare with this is pretty easy. It's just a gentle wash. We tell patients to use a gentle um, moisturizing agent. I often will recommend something with a growth factor in it, so you're encouraging collagen growth. Um, from the outside just as we're treating with the laser procedure. So how is that? You doing okay? Oh, yes. So that just gives you a short little demo. You can see in some of these areas of the skin that you're starting to see the pinkness after treatment. We're going to finish with her face. The whole procedure itself usually takes about 12 to 15 minutes for the face. Neck and chest and hands um, just add a little bit of additional time. If you have any questions, please contact us. Again, this is Dr. Melanie Palm at Art of Skin MD in San Diego, California. Visit our website, www.artofskinmd.com.